Champions League, Real Sociedad dream of man beauty the win. When Real Sociedad raced into the Champions League by finishing fourth in last season's La Liga and hammering Lyon 4-0 over two legs in August final qualifying round, long-serving skipper Zabi Preto had only one wish, to be drawn in the same group as Manchester United. The 30-year-old plate-macking midfielder told BBC Sport, Ever since I was small, I have always really liked Manchester United. I used to have an Eric Cantona shirt, he was my favorite player. They are a mythical club, one of the biggest in the world, and the stadium has always really attracted me as well. Preto got his wish, of course, with La Real placed alongside United, Shakhtar Danetsk and Bayer Leverkusen in a tough-looking group A. However, his dreams are now in danger of turning sour. Sociedad have endured a disappointing start to their La Liga campaign, winning just twice in their opening nine games. The San Sebastian-based club have also suffered in the Champions League, losing their opening to group fixtures with a 2-0 home defeat against Ukrainian champion Shakhtar followed by the last minute 2-1 loss at Leverkusen. And on a personal level, Preto's long-held ambition of playing that Old Trafford was placed in jeopardy when he sustained a high injury in last month's 4-1 league defeat at Barcelona. He returned to action with a brief substitute appearance since Saturday's much-needed 2-1 victory over Valencia, boosting his chances of returning to the starting lineup for Wednesday's game in Manchester. Whether he starts or has to settle for a place on the bench, Preto is determined, however, to ensure nothing detracts from his team's opportunity to appear on one of the most famous stages in world football, and Sociedad fans certainly share their captain's excitement. Their allocation of nearly 6,000 tickets for the game quickly sold out. We've had so many years without playing in Europe, including three seasons in the Segunda Division, and we have to make sure we enjoy these times now, said Prigo. We just have to do our best. We know that La Liga is our most important competition, and in the Champions League we want to enjoy it, be competitive and try to get into the knockout stage. Sociedad's sudden rise into European football's elite came as a major surprise after a recent history of mid-table mediocrity. Indeed, this time last year they appeared to be on course for a dreary struggle against relegation before embarking upon an astonishing run of just a defeat from their final 28 games to secure an unlikely fourth-place finish. Throughout that magnificent six-month spell, La Real were particularly notable for their free-scoring style, especially at their home stadium, the Anoto. They scored no less than 20 goals in their final six home games of the season, allowing exciting attacking trio Imanol Abirateki, Antoine Griezmann and Carlos Dila to all reach double figures for the campaign.